right beyond the water upon the land lies a pretty city small but grand full of fun adventures every day and lots of friends who like to play but it won't take so long until something goes wrong it's time for heroes out every fire soon Polly Polly car looks out for clues For calamity growing faster than the struggle though won't ever last Cause when things go so wrong Our heroes are strong It's time for heroes Call the heroes Heroes of the City. The Mysterious Thief. There. It's important everything looks perfect so visitors will spend time at our zoo. <laughs> yeah, Elmo, the water sure looks lovely, doesn't it? Ah, I see you're hungry. Well, I was just about to go and get myself something for lunch. I promised to buy you and the others something really yummy on my way back. Bye-bye, animals. I'll be right back. Hi, Azufi. Want to go to the cafe with me? Yeah, why not? I'm just... Great. Come on, hurry up. You know when the weather is this good, the best seats get taken right away. Yeah, for sure. Let's go. You should have been there yesterday. Everyone was there. It was totally wild. Trabby dabby doo, trabby dabby dee, trabby dabby 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 doo. Hi there. Help! Thieves! Huh? Thieves? Thieves? Oh no! Are you serious, Frankie? Isn't it terrible? I can't believe it. This box was full of apples just a moment ago. Then I was going to get a box of pears. And when I returned, the apples were all gone. Really? A whole box? It's strange that they would disappear like that. Disappear? This is obviously the work of a thief. A thief who likes apples. Lots and lots of apples. Hmm. What kind of a thief would steal apples? A thief with an excellent taste in fruit. Well, the pears do look delicious. You don't think I could have a little taste? Mm. All right, then. Oh, thank you so much! But don't you remember that? When there was a fire over by the open-air cafe? Oh, yeah. I remember. You threw yourself into the fire and you rescued that poor little cat. That was really brave of you, Fiona. The way you did that was so awesome. It's nothing. You know, someone had to take care of it. Polly was so scared he almost jumped out of his tires. I was definitely not scared. Not at all. I might have been a little careful, but not scared. Ah! Emergency services. Yes? What in the world? Oh, I see. Okay, over and out. Frankie Fruit has been robbed of a whole box of apples. Wow. Yes, and you know what needs to be done. Because it's action time! Action time. Now how will I get around? Uh, ah well, it's just an old crutch. It's not the end of the world. 
Hey, Frankie. We heard what happened to your apples. I've cried so much. I'm afraid I might turn into rust. I didn't even get a chance to taste them. How rude. Did you see the thief? No, I was in the back getting the pears. How long were you gone for? It was only a few seconds. Hmm. It's strange that they didn't take the whole box. Did you hear anything out of the ordinary? I didn't hear anything. That is very strange. This sort of thing has never happened in our city. Every effort feels... It feels so, so fruitless. You can relax, Frankie. Detective Polly will handle the case. I think some good old detective work is needed if we're going to solve this mystery. Look over there. There's a half-eaten apple on the ground. <clears throat> well, I have to look on the bright side. At least I still have my pair. What? Ah! Oh no, pull my feathers. My pair! I think I've been robbed. Oh no, not him too. Hello there. What's going on? Someone has stolen my pair. I was sitting here with my broken crutch next to my pear on the sidewalk, and just when I was going to eat it, I noticed it was gone. Hmm. First apples, and now a pear. It appears that we are dealing with a fruit thief. But what happened to your crutch? I don't know. I accidentally dropped it when I ran off to see what happened with Frankie Fruit. And while I was away, someone must have stepped on it. I see. So someone must have been here while you were gone. Did you see anyone? No, no one. And we didn't see anyone either. No. The thief must have hit around this corner in order to later sneak up on Calamity Crow and take his pair. I think we should go this way, Fiona, to search for more clues. rap did you do rap did you da What a lovely day. I cannot believe it! My baguettes! Where on earth are my baguettes? Someone help! Please! I've been robbed! I've been thieved! I've been burgled! Please help! Benny the Baker? What's going on? My baguettes! Oh, my bread is gone! Aha! Look, a clue. The very same thief we are tracking down. He must have passed by this way, too. You can relax, Benny. Now we're on the thief's trail. Oh, dear, oh, dear, oh, dear. Well, I guess I'll have to go bake some more. I can't believe those thieving bandits and scoundrels. Look! Crumbs! And over there? A core of an apple. Hi, Frankie. Why are you sad? Hi, Digsy. Yeah, I am devastated. A whole box of apples has disappeared. Gone without a trace. Oh, yeah. That does sound terrible. Yeah, but I am on my way to get new apples. See you. Goodbye, Frankie. Hmm. All that talk about apples sure makes me hungry. Might be time for me to take a little snack. Oh, great. Hi there, Digsy. Have you seen anyone pass this way? No, but somebody's obviously had a party here without inviting me. Figures. But those baguettes look really tasty. They could have at least cleaned up after they were done. Yeah, I'd say. Just how big is this thief, Polly? Well, it's got bigger feet than anyone. I know that for sure. And a thief that eats this much must also have a pretty big stomach. Oh, you don't suspect me, do you? <laughs> no, of course not. Come on, Fiona. Let's follow the tracks. Big or small, we have to catch this thief, Fiona. Are you ready? This is it. Hello in there. Come out with your hands up. This is the police! Come out here! 
Huh? But... Oh. <laughs> uh -oh. <laughs> a little elephant calf. How's that for a big and dangerous thief? <laughs> he must have escaped from the zoo. We'd better take him there right away. <laughs> Come here, you little food thief. <laughs> Come on. Polly, this is probably easier said than done. Will you please help me? Hmm. No. I think I have a better idea. Tra di da di do, tra di da di di. Wow! Oh, 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 oh. Oh, will you look at that? I'm lucky after all. Look, here is your pear thief. Oh my, an elephant! I would never have guessed! <laughs> <laughs> I've never seen a thieving bandit and scoundrel with a trunk before. That's funny, he seems to love my baguette. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much! I just got back and noticed I accidentally left the gate open. <laughs> so, little Elmo has had an adventure. It's lucky you found our little Elmo before he had an accident. Don't mention it. It's our job. But please make sure to close the gate properly in the future and keep little Elmo in his enclosure. So we don't have to have any more trunk thieving experiences in this city. <laughs> <laughs> Did you catch the fruit thief? <laughs> yeah, it was just a hungry elephant calf who had escaped from the zoo. Fiona was so scared. She almost oiled herself before Elmo came out. She was terrified. I was definitely not scared. I might have been a little careful, but I was not scared. Anyhow, good work, you guys. You are mine, the animals, and the whole city's heroes. Well, I don't know about that, but it sure is nice to have everything back to normal. Don't be modest now, Polly. I thought you were really awesome today. Mm-hmm. Maybe I don't need the crutch anymore. Hmm. The Heroes of the City movie app, an all-in-one children's application. Watch movies, enjoy your favorite TV show anytime, anywhere. Play games, let the characters come to life. Be creative, become your own artist. More than six hours of entertaining movies, nine exciting games, collect trophies to unlock your own secret surprise. The Heroes of the City movie app is the complete entertainment program for your mobile device.